Hi, I'm Ole England and today I'm trying out the Huge & Kettner Grandmeister Deluxe 40 tube amp head. The Grandmeister Deluxe 40 is a new fully programmable all-tube powered amplifier from Huge & Kettner. What is really cool about this amp is not only is it small, it's packed with tons of different features. It is 40 watt powered by 4 EL84 tubes and 3 preamp tubes. 4 different game modes, you have Clean, Crunch, Lead and Ultra. It has built in effects like Delay, Flanger, Phaser, chorus, tremolo, reverb, and a noise gate. Now all of these settings including the channel, EQ knobs and effects can be stored to up to 128 presets and switched using a MIDI controller. It stores every parameter, gain, EQ, effects, etc. So you can just quickly load up your favorite preset using a foot switch. You can also control all these parameters using an app for iPad if you rather do that. So the front panel is very straightforward and the single chain goes right to left. Starts with the input, then you have the knob to choose what game mode to be in. Clean, crunch, lead and ultra. Next to it you have a boost button which actually reacts different depending on which game mode you're in. Next we have the gain, volume, bass, middle, treble and reverb. Jumping across the buttons here, we have a master section with a low-end resonance knob, presence and master volume knob. Now jumping back to the four buttons, here you have a preset store button. Just hold the store button and all settings will be stored to a preset. Here you have noise gate on and off and the knob to control the threshold you'll find at the back of the amp. Effects loop on and off and last but not by any means the least we have the effects access button. If you click this button, the knobs over here to the right turns into controlling a different function. What function it is, you can see up here. So the treble knob is now delay level, the volume knob controls what type of modulation effect you want, and so on. So let's check out in the back of the amp. Oh shit. Ugh. At the back of the amp, you'll find power soak options. So if you don't need 40 watt full output, you can step it down to 20, 5 and even 1 watt. Perfect when you want to push the amplifier but play on the lower volume, like in a bedroom. You can even switch off the speaker output and just go direct if you want. You don't have to have a speaker cabinet plug in when switched to this option. And over here we have a direct output with a cabinet emulation powered by Redbox. And uh, unlike many direct outputs on other amplifiers, this one actually sound awesome. The demo of the song you heard in the beginning of this video, I recorded using the red box out. No post-processing whatsoever. I just decided to go with it because it sounded so awesome. Next to that, you have the noise gate threshold knob, line out, effects loop, MIDI in and out. And here's the pedal board so you can access all the 128 presets that you saved. And uh, switching between the presets is just flawless. You're not getting any hiccups or pops. There's also tap tempo. And if you set the pedal board to stomp box mode, the bank up and the bank down buttons turn into switches for the boost and effects. And if you have an iPad, you can also access the parameters and presets. You can control the whole amp using the app.
The Grandmeister Deluxe 40 is a fun and feature-packed amp. It's probably the most feature-packed mini amp I've ever tried, but it should not be taken as a small amp. It's a very powerful amplifier that suits a lot of different applications. And with the onboard effects and preset managing, you don't really need a lot more than this. And to top it off, it sounds absolutely awesome in all channel modes. Even the direct out sounds killer, which is usually the downfall for a lot of amplifiers that implement that feature. For more information about the Huge & Kettner Grandmeister Deluxe 40, check out hugeandkettner.com. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Hey guys, thank you for watching my video. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. And if you want to interact with me, be sure to follow me on Facebook and Instagram. See ya!